So if you if you try your go sit where you were. Okay, now bend your knees. Good. Now press on the gas. Brum brum. Stand your your let's see, your right foot is the gas, your left foot is the brake. That makes sense. Gas, brake, gas, brake, gas. Break. Okay. We want to keep with the front wheels. We want to keep the same track width as the, uh, we'll keep them centered. And I discovered that the track width is 34 inches on center. So we're going to try to keep these wheels 34 inches apart. Here's 34 from center to center. Okay, we're back and now what we're going to do is we're going to, to uh, make the front axle. The front axle will have these pieces, excuse me, and they'll go like this. Um, and we're going to make the axle out of um, three-quarter inch plumbing, black iron plumbing pipe, and that's what we're going to make the whole frame out of. So it's over to the saw again. Okay, I have uh, three-quarter inch black iron plumbing pipe, and that's what we're going to make the frame out of. Um, it's three-quarter inch pipe, and that's the inside diameter, three-quarter. It's actually a, little, actually a little bit larger than three-quarters on the inside. And the outside is about an inch. So uh, this is going to be our frame material. This stuff is available. Um, what I need to do is, as you can see, I've cut it at a, at a 10 degree angle. And we're going to cut um, both ends at a 10 degree angle to match the angles that we set our spindles at. So to do that, what I need to do is, I've got a block of wood, as you can see in my saw. And that block of wood is my 10 degree angle block. Okay, ready to tighten that down? And go. Get it real tight. Got it? Yeah. Whoa! Okay, and we'll turn that on. Okay, so I've cut the angle here to match the same angle as our spindles. I believe they're correct. They look pretty good. So now what we have to do is set this weld up here. This might take a little bit of time and you might need more than two hands to do it. Now the one thing I'm going to do that I forgot to do before we weld this is I'm going to clean the ends of this pipe with the um, wire brush wheel because there are a lot of, uh, there's a, usually a coating of, of grease, as you can see, and some kind of other coating on the outside. And I don't want that coating and all those contaminants to get into the weld, so I'm going to clean the ends of the pipe before we weld it. We're gonna, we'll go do that now. And you want to go a little further down the, down the, there you go. Good. That's good. In there. Yeah. That's it. 